Good afternoon, everybody. June 9th, 2021 at 2.04 p.m. This is going to be a quick video as I have some other stuff I'm working on for you guys, but this has to be shown. I just want to thank spaceweathernews.com. We all know suspicious observers, and we know many people have these charts on their websites too. I just happen to come here pretty often, but something really cool just happened on the sun. Also, pretty scary. And I also want to be fairly clear that this was not Earth-facing, but you're going to see a pretty significant explosion on the upper right around the 2 o'clock on the sun towards the end of this clip. You're looking at the last 72 hours of our sun. You could see this at any moment. Check this out. There we go. Look at that explosion that took place on the sun. I'm going to slow it down for you guys. Now, it's going to be easier for me to go through the snapshots, which I have pulled already, and it looks like this was an X-flare. Now, keep in mind, again, this is not Earth-facing. This is the upper right quadrant of the sun. That's why I said that 2 o'clock position, basically. So it's kind of coming this way. Earth facing would be towards us as if we're looking at the screen from Earth. Now look at this. So this was the initial flash. And when you see this symbol here, a lot of times it'll be an X. And that represents an X-class flare. I'm not exactly positive if that's what this was. But take a look at this. Here's the next frame. And I'll go through them fairly quickly. That is our second shot. Look at that arc right there. And just to give you an idea of how small Earth is, Earth is about the size of the tip of my pointer right there. So this entire arc is multiple times bigger than the Earth. Earth itself just this extension off the sun this explosion moving on to the next frame we see that kind of breaking up this is hundreds of thousands of miles off the surface of the sun just the size of this is unbelievable we now see it shooting off past the ability of the cameras that are in space these satellites the SDO satellites and then as we continue on, we see some of the filament pulling back down into the sun and actually landing on the surface of the sun, almost like a meteor strike. So very, very crazy stuff. I have it set about halfway through because, again, this is the last 72 hours of our sun turning. And we kind of want to catch the end here to see this part. So I'll hit this and we'll go ahead and watch. Watch this in real time. But boom, that is just unbelievable. I'll play it a few times here over and over. Just amazing. I know many of you that follow and look at the sun on a daily basis, you will know that this is fairly significant. Even though it's not Earth-facing and it's not really going to affect us per se, it's still something that makes you wonder when this type of thing is going to happen when it's facing us. My friends, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this short video. Just wanted to get the news out to you for those of you that study the space weather. I'll be back later on today or tomorrow morning with our normal updates. Thank you all so much. Bye-bye. Stop right there, my friends. If you have not already, click that subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell icon. Click all and you will get all notifications from this channel. And trust me, you won't be disappointed.